let's go back to the beginning and talk about our CVBADC again. Okay, so we said contractions, variability, baseline, accelerations, decelerations, and a change over time. Okay, um, so keep these things in mind. You can literally, uh, you know, after you go and read a tracing and you're writing your note, you can literally, and this is exactly what I do, I just write C, V, B, D, A, C, and then I know I need to comment on contractions, and then I need to comment on variability, and then the baseline, D cells, X cells, and then change. And so I can literally just take these things like I did at the beginning, define them, Q3 minutes, Variability, we'll say is moderate. Baseline, 135 beats per minute. Positive accelerations, Q5 minutes. Oh, sorry, that was D cells, so we'll say no D cells. Positive accelerations, Q5 minutes and no change, so mom's doing well, okay? So this is, this is an acceptable note. Um, in most places, some places may want you to write it out, but you know you can take the same thing um, and write it out. Mom's contracting every three minutes. There is moderate variability on a baseline rate of 135 beats per minute with no decelerations. Accelerations are present at five minutes. There's no change. This tracing is reassuring. All right. So that sums it up. I hope you learned a thing or two about um, fetal heart tracing. I had fun putting this together, and let me know if there are other things you'd like to learn about. Take care.